got to tell you that this is for the International Tag Team Championship belts. Maka Singh and Vulcan Singh, two big men, the Singh Singh boys, are the reigning champions, and the challengers are the former champions, the Bulldogs, Davey Boy Smith, and the Dynamite Kid. Where are the Sing Sing boys? Let me ask you a question. The British Bulldogs have no right to jump them. And they yeah, look... It's the other way around. Well, what I saw... Yeah, yeah, what you saw. Yeah, what you saw. Here's Davey Boy Smith going against Bucka Singh. Gives him the big headbutt, and there's Dynamite throwing in his two bits worth as well, and out goes Buckin. Buckin, the big man in the ring, weight-wise, at 380 pounds. Vulcan Singh at 320. The Bulldogs much smaller, but hardly lightweights. Davy Boy at 245, and Dynamite at 228. And of course, you know the British Bulldogs as longtime world champions. Well, we everybody knows that, Ed. Everybody knows that they're a great team, and they ran into a little trouble here. They lost their title here about four weeks ago to the Singh Boys, and tonight they're all fired up. They just got back from Japan, spent 20 hours in the air in the airplane, and I'll tell you, I think the toll will take their place, because I don't think at this moment that the British Bulldogs look the same like they did when they left. Well, they might have a little problem shaking off the jet lag. I don't know. But certainly their tour of Japan was nothing short of a triumph. They can't really doubt that the British Bulldogs were up for this match tonight. Do you think they got, they got yeah. what it takes to win well, the championship? The only thing I would be concerned about were I in the Bulldogs camp was they just stepped off an airplane. Well, true. They had a long flight, you know, but that shouldn't stop two great athletes. They should be tough. And that would be your excuse, though, wouldn't it? Well, it wouldn't be mine because, you yeah, see, okay. I traveled for years and years and got off an airplane and got in the ring and went 90 minutes, so yeah, it really did bother you. me. You're a legend. Oh, I'm still a legend. I'm still a good legend to legend in that. your own mind. Disqualified, Muck and Singh and Book and Singh, they retained their belts, and I humbly submit they did it to save their skins. Well, they such, did it. It was such a, a tremendous match. I don't think they would deliberately get this Deliberately game. did it. Let's meet Davy Boy and the Dynamite Kid right now with Jim Davies. We had him beat tonight. He might have called me off guard at the beginning. We'll be the Dynamite Kid. We had him beat. We had him beat in front of all these people. I gave him this big power slam. I picked up dynamite. Flying in, boy, he was all over. What did Milkham Singh do? He drove his big fat leg across Wayne Hurt's head, the referee. Well, that's fine, Milkham Singh, because the Bulldogs are back. We're back from Japan, and we're back in Calgary. And next week, the British Bulldogs are going to come back in a no disqualification match. You can drop your leg across Wayne Hurt. You can drop your leg across Stu Hurt. You can drop your leg across any Hurt. Because I don't care, because we're not going to go back home with those belts, let me tell you that. Dynamite, you know something, Jay, if you want to play ball that way, that's fine with me and David Boy Smith. We can either way, we can either go by the rules or not by the rules. We don't need a referee. Vulcan Singh, Mocky Singh, you come back here next Friday, put the belts on the line one more time, and we will guarantee right now to all those people out there that we will take those cha and championship belts and once again become the international heavyweight champions. Okay, and Davey Boy, there is no doubt, if this had been a no disqualification bout, those belts would be around your waists right now. They would be around our waist. But we, we don't, we want to come in the ring. We want to wrestle fair and square and go by the rules. But all these guys, they don't want to go by the rules. Well, that's fine with the British Bulldogs because we can break the rules too, Jim. All righty, thank you very much. The British Bulldogs. Now let's go to Ed, who's with those Sing Sing Boys.